This is the outside view of an alley dock. He's starting in a straight back using cone number one as a reference point to know that he's straight. Once his rear wheels reach cone number one, he starts to turn the steering wheel to the left. He's now looking in his driver's side mirror at cone number two, drawing in his head an imaginary line that goes from his rear tire to cone number two. Once he's in line with that path that he drew out in his head, he'll stop, straighten his wheels, and proceed back. Once he's crossed the plane of cone number two, he'll correct his wheels, correct his bus to make sure it's straight. Once the bus is straight, he'll stop, straighten out the wheels, and continue straight back. Now what he's watching for out of his driver's side mirror is cone number three. This is the cone that he uses as a reference point to know when to stop to get his bumper lined up in between these two cones. Cone number three. Once he's stopped, he's also going to look through his side window at this cone, cone number four. And he's looking through this window at cone number four to make sure he's lined up. Once he's lined up, he'll secure his bus. He'll get out, walk to the back of the bus, and he's gonna stop at two positions. This is position number one. And then he'll proceed across inside the containment zone to position number two. If you can make this walk through the containment zone, your bus is straight. He'll then proceed around the outside of the bus and back into the driver's seat to signify that he's completed the maneuver. And he'll do that with the honk of a horn and a thumbs up.